What's up YouTube, it's your boy Carvincer Ridge and welcome back to another video. And in today's video, we're gonna be doing a little POV drive, man. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna chop it up in a car, um, see what this thing can do. Like what I was talking about in the review is that one thing like I do hate about this screen though too, uh, real quick is that it takes a while for all the apps to load. The screen is kind of slow. Um, hopefully they fix that with the newer the newer cars. What I was saying, what I what I really hate about the car is it's emergency assist for it, emergency braking. I always turn it off. And then um, right now we're gonna drive in uh, normal, driving normal. Um, so let's go ahead and get on the road, man. Let's go ahead and get on the road. Even on standard mode, it got a little, it got a little, it got, got a little punch. You know what I'm saying? It got a little punch, but. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I really do like this car. I kinda, <clears throat> I can't wait till I get my Q60 now. Q60 gonna be dope when I'm able to get it. So, I can't wait. But I do wanna address this real quick. Remember I made a video about, um, you know, why I didn't get the Q50 over the G37, pretty much. Cause I was contemplating it too. I wanted to say like, did my, this isn't changed since, you know, I'm driving this car, of course. Um, I'm gonna say it didn't change. Like, I'm still glad that I bought my G37 instead of a Q50 as my first Infinity. Cause like I said, I believe if you are buying an Infinity, like the true Infinity experience, to be honest, is buying a BQ first. Um, so I'm happy that I was able to get the G37 first. Nothing wrong with this car, man. It's absolutely fun to drive, but that VQ, man, it's just something different with the VQ than the, uh, than the BR, but, um, but yeah. My mind definitely didn't change. We'll get on the freeway in a little bit too, so we can get some freeway driving and stuff like that, but car nice, man. I like the steering wheel of it. You know, really loose, the paddle shifters and stuff like that. We'll play in that. <clears throat> we'll play with that later in the video. Let's give it a little pull. I ain't gonna lie, man. This thing is always ready to go, boy. Definitely do give you those Give you that fun, give you that thrill feeling when you're driving this car for sure. Let's put it on Swerve Plus on the freeway. So you can feel it switching when you do the drive modes. This thing don't be playing. I'm trying to tell y'all. This thing don't be playing. Let's go ahead and put it in sport. Drop it down again. <laughs> this thing fun to drive, man. I'm not gonna lie. This thing is fun to drive. It's hella fun to drive. Like, you're gonna have fun driving this car for sure. Like, you're not gonna get bored of it. It's gonna be real fun to drive. How we doing on them curves? It handles really good too. I'm not gonna lie, it handles really good. Ooh, a dead deer right there. Wow, it's crazy. It's funny cause a lot of people who I know is like, Ridge, I can see you in this. I see you in that photo, man. You, you sure you want a Q60? Of course I want a Q60, man. That's my steez, man. I want me a Q60. Bad. Q60 Red Sport. I love the look of that car. Ever since they thought about dropping it, like when they had it a concept car, I was like, damn, I want that car. You know what I'm saying? So. Didn't want to get it at first. You know, when I bought the G37, I was like, yeah, I'm gonna buy me a G, cause something I've been wanting to. And then I bought the G35, cause 
it's something that I always wanted too, so. This car, man, is crazy. <laughs> Dang, this what it was. You can you can hear the engine, like I said, man. But you know, I want to hear I want to hear that exhaust note. I want to hear that exhaust note, boy. I ain't even gonna lie. I get my Q60 though for sure. Can't wait to get my Q60. But I hope you guys enjoyed this little POV drive that I put together. Um, just wanted to show you guys from a point of view of how the way it looks and stuff like that. Do a couple of little pulls and stuff like that. Um, Cause I gotta get ready to return it in a couple of hours. Actually, in three hours, three more hours is all I got left with this car. So. Hope you guys did enjoy this, um, these videos that I put together. Hope I made them entertaining for you guys. Just wanted to get something real quick on the channel, man, because um, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Like the whole identity behind my channel is all around. You know what I'm saying? Like uh, I don't want to just put up just straight G37 and G35 content out. I like to mix it up, you know, every now and then, and like to throw something different on there you know it could be an infinity or it could be you know a dodge or ford whatever you know what i'm saying like i just want to mix it up and stuff like that like i know like for me as a viewer i would like to see people like you know mix it up every now and then you know what i'm saying like not every video be the same if you get what i'm saying and i still i am still building my car that's always gonna happen and stuff like that both of the cars and stuff but I want to just do some different type of content some fun content and to get back to doing stuff what made me really want to start doing YouTube you know what I'm saying like I feel like sometimes people lose track of that like why did you start YouTube in the first place like I really do have fun I really do have fun like you know um, getting these cars for you know for the weekend and doing ride-alongs and stuff and seeing other people faces and having them enjoy the car as well and stuff like that so i like that i really do i really do like that that's really been a big part of my channel you know what i'm saying and i wanted to keep that going you know it's not like nothing like i brought on there before like you know the porsche and uh you know scad and hellcat and all that you know what i'm saying and the gtr is you know it's different but you know it's just a little fun content know what I decided to film and stuff like that I had real fun making this content over the weekend I'm gonna record my last drive when I'm uh, getting ready to drop it off but I'm gonna go ahead and go get some gas probably go grab a bite to eat cuz I still got a couple of more hours with it I just filmed my last reaction um, and then yeah I record my last drive next but I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did please go ahead and like the video it helps me out a lot when you guys like the video if you did like it just go ahead and like it um if you haven't subscribed yet go ahead and subscribe my channel is absolutely lit like i always say i always do some amazing things on this channel and i still got amazing things on the way um a whole lot of good things on the way so y'all stay tuned let's go ahead and Fast and the Furious type shit. <laughs> I really don't drive like that, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not an asshole when I'm driving and stuff like that. But gotta make some good content every now and then, right? But um, I'm gonna go down this little curve because this little um, it's exit where I'm getting off at got like a little curve, so y'all can kind of see it a little bit before I um, let this video go. But I hope you guys really did like this POV drive, man. And let me know, should I do more 
like chill like drives like this in the G35 and the G37 because I do like driving I do like doing POV drives too I do want to go to more scenic like you know routes um, with my G35 and my G37 to kind of show y'all a little bit of California y'all may not be from out here so um, you know show y'all a couple of things of what California got to offer and stuff like that but right now we behind some slow cars going 40 miles per hour to get off the freeway um, but yeah Look at all that traffic over there, y'all. Can y'all see that? They going, that's going to Vallejo, too. See that red G37, too? I see it. I see you, boy. I see you, boy. See this little curve down here? California really nice, though. It's expensive, but it's really nice. I ain't gonna lie. Real nice, boy. Around this little, little curve of down here. Let's go. Dang, I wish they wasn't in my way, man. Uh, that was the whole point of me just going down this curve and stuff like that. and Y'all not being in my way. Man, y'all gotta be in my way. Why y'all gotta be in my way? But, <laughs> but anyways, hope you guys did enjoy this video. Um, and I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace. She poppin' and droppin', she rockin' toppin', no stoppin'. Got me deep in my pockets, I'm about to give her my wallet. And I'm like...